Ladies and gents, I'm back with another Fortnite video, and as always, if you guys can support me as part of the Supporter Creator Program, I would appreciate it a lot. And I just want to point out, this is these are my first impressions on the Crankshot Sniper Rifle, and my opinions in this video are not final. In fact, I'm going to be bringing you guys my final thoughts and my final review on this bad boy as soon as I can, so if you're interested in that, of course, feel free to subscribe. See you guys in the next one, and enjoy my first impressions on this thing. Alright, ladies and gents, I'm back, and this is going to be your first look and my first impression on the brand new uh, Crankshot Sniper that is in the four Nightmares Llamas. I don't have it perked up. Uh, this is... I'm just going to be using the weapon. I'm going to be testing it out, uh, and hopefully I can actually test that out because these guys right here, they went ham with all these trap tunnels, like, big time. Oh, shit, they shouldn't have placed that floor there. Oh, they dropped down. Alright, so, I played a game yesterday with this crank shot, and uh, yeah, for some reason it didn't record itself, but basically, this thing is really, really good. It has some pretty decent impact. As you guys can see, every like three shots or so, it like staggers the, um, oh shit. Oh, this guy wants flanks for the ore. So yeah, this dude right here, guys, he dropped 800 rough ore, and I picked it up. I was like, fuck it. Might as well, right? It's free rough ore. Like, you know how many wall launchers I can make with that? Um, but... Yeah, it's okay. I think I'm really good on ore now, so... Uh, I don't really think I'll be giving him the planks, because I do need to get some planks soon. And by the way, I didn't steal the rough ore. He dropped it, like, because he didn't want it. Just pointing it out. Uh, I'm getting off topic. The crank shot. This thing is awesome. Alright, I don't have it perked up. I don't have it, like, you know, it's not a legendary. So I don't have it like leveled up, but this thing is a level 93 weapon that isn't even perked correctly and look at all that damage I mean, I know I was getting help from that drone, but the damage that this thing provides is actually really good And uh, yeah, it's just a really really good consistent sniper uh, Let's take care of this husky husk right here And as you guys can see it does some pretty good uh, does Some pretty good damage. Let's take care of this lady uh, however one of the things that I've noticed uh, when using this bad boy is the recoil at the medium ranges sometimes makes it so that you can't really go like all out and you can't really just go like fully automatic like you kind of have to like take your shots like at this range I can sort of like take my shots but I mean I don't really have to like tap fire but as you guys can see you know sometimes you do sort of like tend to uh, lose some accuracy uh, with it. Look at that. That husk just got straight up melted. But yeah, long story short, I'm really, really happy with this weapon, and I can't wait to get a legendary version and bring you guys my final review, because even though, you know, this is a first impression video, uh, you know, I still want to test out the weapon as a legendary and see how much damage it can actually do and how well it stacks against the competition. Uh, look at that, this blaster is just going to get destroyed, and I'm still going to have 10 bullets in the magazine. So this weapon, in my opinion, would be like really good as like a third weapon. As you guys know, I like to have my Miss Monster the leader. Look at that, this uh, blaster is just staggering. And keep in mind, this isn't a Shadow Shard weapon. This isn't even a Legendary. This is a, an epic weapon in a level 100 mission that's doing massive damage. Okay, I kind of missed a lot of my shots there, but half health on a blaster. That's not that bad. I mean, you could just run an obliterator. Even a level 82 obliterator will like destroy blasters with like two headshots if you haven't perked up correctly. But this isn't an obliterator. I think, like I said, this is just a weapon that you run on your third slot. Uh, you have your mist monster deleter or your heavy hitter on your secondary. And then, you know, for the long ranges, you can run this uh, crank shot sniper. And yeah, if you're not convinced so far, by what the gameplay has shown you, honestly, I don't, I don't really know what I need to show you to convince you. I mean, maybe the the review will convince you that this is a great weapon. Oh, and apparently, um, weapons like the Rat Rod weapons, they have like their own special sixth perk. So yeah, um, I don't even know what's the last perk for the Crankshot Sniper, and hopefully it's like a really, really good perk. Maybe like a perk that increases damage. That would be nice. Or a perk that reduces recoil would also be really, really helpful in this weapon as well. 
I don't know, guys. I'm I'm just telling you guys that this thing's pretty beastly, and you should get your hands on it. Uh, another thing that I just want to point out about this weapon is uh, this little beast right here. Uh, so as you guys can see, this thing is also very effective at hip firing within a four tile range. So I'm gonna set this up real quick because I don't want to get overwhelmed. But yeah, I got this husky husk here, and I'm just going to just hip fire. And I'm going to obliterate them. These guys are following me. And again, it's a level 93 epic weapon. It doesn't have the 6th perk. It's not perked up correctly. And it is just melting these level 100 husks. So yes, this weapon is Salvaje Approved. Should I start saying Salvaje Approved or not Salvaje Approved on my reviews? I don't, I don't think I should do that. Oh, hello there. Uh, okay, yep, alright. Um, yep, I'm just going to go back. I'm just gonna drop these here so that epic boss takes some damage and I'm gonna use this so the adrenaline rush sort of like I mean the negative abilities sort of like wear off all right so I'm guessing the crank shot can't oh my god I think I just fucked up this entire trap tunnel oh my god these guys are gonna be so fucking pissed all right they're not pissed or maybe they are and I don't know because this brand new chat isn't really the best but hey they did say they were going to be fixing the chat and bringing a couple of great changes to it, so I'm really happy about that. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much it when it comes down to the crank shot. It's definitely not, you know, a weapon that's going to be destroying and, you know, doing massive damage to miss monsters. But it is a really good alternative for the medium range, and it is a pretty good sniper. Like, if you're looking for a good sniper, the crank shot is great. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the first look, my first impressions on the brand new sniper for Fortnite Save the World for Nightmares, and I will be seeing you friends on the next one.